Hey, my name is John, and I had a pretty normal upbringing. But everything changed when I turned 18. I was applying to college when I discovered that my social security number didn't match my name. I thought it was just a mistake and asked my school counselor for help. But he said that there might be another explanation. He went on to check my name in the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children database. And that's when we discovered that I'd been listed as missing for 15 years. I was so confused. I mean, this couldn't be true. Or... Because I looked just like my dad, I knew we were related. And although my mom wasn't around, he had always told me that she had left us after giving birth to me. While I went back home, my school counselor contacted the FBI without telling me. They immediately arrived at our home to interview me and to arrest my dad. It was horrible to see him being taken away in handcuffs. And the next day, they introduced me to my mom. She was crying as she took me into her arms, calling me her baby and going on about how much she had missed me. She even told me we would never be separated again. But I had no clue who this woman was. It was just awkward. I wanted my mom to be happy, though, so we moved in together, and she told me how and why my dad had stolen me from her. Apparently, my parents split up when I was three years old, and they couldn't agree who should have custody of me. One day, when my dad picked me up after school, he drove us from Alabama to Ohio to start a new life, and my mom never saw me again. She told me how painful it was for her all those years, wondering where I was and if I was okay. At first, I couldn't believe that my dad had taken me away from my mother. It was such a cruel thing to do. But I still can't hate my dad. He raised me well. He always made sure I studied hard in school, which is why I'm one of the top students. And that's also why, when it was time for him to be sentenced, I said I didn't want him to go to jail, because he had taken such great care of me. The judge agreed that my dad was a good father, but stealing a child is still a serious offense. So, now my dad's serving a four-year prison sentence. I went to visit him recently, and he told me his version of why he had stolen me from my mother. He said that my mom had threatened to tell the police that he was beating me. So if he hadn't taken me away from her, my mom would have made sure he never saw me again. But of course, my mom says that none of that is true, and to be honest, I don't know who to believe but I do know I forgive my dad. Currently, I'm living with my mom, and although I love her, it's weird because it still feels like she's a complete stranger. Don't get me wrong. I'm trying my best to build a relationship with her, but I don't think I'll ever love her the way I love my dad because he is the reason I became a responsible and honest person. Please let me know in the comments how you would handle this situation. Would you forgive your dad for stealing you from your mom? Thanks for listening, and please subscribe to this channel.